The other day, oh my God, I'm so glad you can curse on AOL. You can, right? Yeah. Oh my God, listen to this, Brad. <laughs> I tell a story in the show about when I was about 218 pounds, so, uh, you know, skinny. I was, uh, <laughs> I was in Vegas, yeah, right, right, about average. I uh, said, okay, you know what? I was, I was out to lunch with my two skinny friends, and we talk about how I got very furious with them, and this really happened, and we're not friends anymore, because they would not have dessert because I wanted dessert. And they were like, we're not hungry. And I'm like, look, you fucking horse. What is, <laughs> what is being hungry have to do with dessert? Hello? <laughs> so I'm telling the story. And as it was written, I put, you guys were staring at that giant cannoli so long, I couldn't tell if you want to eat it or fuck it. <laughs> but guess what? During rehearsal, it just popped out of my mouth. I go, I couldn't decide if you wanted to eat it or jam it up your snatch. <laughs> and we're like, oh, we are so putting that in the show. Because it's like, that's how I talk. And I think it's funny. You just have to be yourself. So thankfully, the serious play stuff happened, then the funny finds a way in. So stand-up fans will like this, too. I'm very right. grateful that you get to meld them, and nobody's ever yelled, you know, hey, this ain't funny, which is great.